Welcome, my name is Matt, Orc Beast 34 and today I'll be showing you how to make your own logo using Pixlr, and it's free. So you want to search Pixlr in Google or whatever, then it shows up with this, and you can go down and click Pixlr Editor, and then it loads up, and create a new uh, create a new image. Then do 500 by 500, which is the uh, logo dimensions. I'm just gonna name this YouTube logo. Uh, okay. So then drag this stuff over since it's blocked by this ad, by whatever ad there is. So this shows navigator, layers, and history. So you can either use the gradient tool which is this or you can use the paint bucket which I'm going to use to color it in which is that the paint bucket so then you select your color uh, okay then you just with the paint bucket selected click it fill it in and th this right here this like uh, by the layer section that adds a new layer so then what you want to do once you add a new layer you want to click the circle and square in the tools bar then like if you want a square you can just drag it as soon as it comes up but you select the circle if you want a circle and then fill shape you select the color you want it to be so I'm going to do gray so then like you try to make this circle that's like even yeah that's good but like it's not like big enough so then you do edit free transform like try to get it big so then since when you do this then it, it'll fill up like the google logo thing if you're using google uh... so then what you do is um... uh... right here by the layers thing again you click that thing with the star and you do inner glow no inner glow you click that size I'd say 35 is usually a good size but you want to switch the color to green or something okay then like y what you can do to make it look better duplicate layer with ri by right clicking so now it's like there but you can't really see it so you do edit free transform make this smaller so it's like that then it's like cool it's like double layer if you don't want that you don't have to do that but I think that looks good so then what you do you go to cooltext.com and you select whatever text you want I guess I'm just gonna do like particle and type in your letter that you want or multiple letters to size uh, 385 you can do that's usually a good size since you can always make it smaller then yes yeah, so that's what it looks like but you can always change the color so you don't have to select a text that has like blue if you want like to change it or something so then you select whatever color I guess green okay there it is finally create logo download the image with the first option there and it should be downloading in the bottom left and then you go to your page. No, you go to the, I mean, the pixel art page. And then you do Control O or Command O if you're on a Mac. And like if, well, like sometimes it downloads like random folders. So then you do Show in Folder. And it's like down there. So now I'm gonna drag it into Miscellaneous Folder. And then do Control O or Command O. So now it's now that I know what folder it's in, I click on it, and it's that one. Open Control A C to select all and copy it. Control V, and then it's like that. But like if you want to change it again, edit free transform. Uh, I want to make it like skinnier, taller, and hold Shift to keep the proportions if you want to keep it. And that looks good. 
click out, apply changes. So that's it. So then you just do file, save. Okay. So then it shows where it's saving to. I'm going to save it to my pictures. Save. So then you go to your YouTube page, click the edit button, edit channel icon, and upload photo. Then select your image, upload it, and there it is. Like you, you, you can adjust the circle to make it like perfect so it fits in that circle. Yeah. So like this is like not exact, so you can always just change it. It's not that hard to do. So yeah, so that's basically it. it it's gonna take like a few minutes to apply. Sometimes it does. Yeah, it's taking a few minutes. So thanks for watching, everyone. And I will see you guys next time. You. Soldier boy, tell. Hey, I got this new dance for y'all called a soldier boy. Just got a punch, then.